Greetings one and all, I am Bruce Scooter here bringing you more Pokemon Gold on the Game Boy, whichever type you'd like to play on. In the last episode we traversed through the ice path and got here to Dragon Den, Blackthorn. This part, we're going to go to the gym, wherever the gym is hiding. I think it's up in this general direction, if I remember. Yes it is. Oh, run of the mill trainer, you say? Well, no, run of the mill trainer. Because I have brought a nice type with me. So that's how we win, folks. With Dugong. Dugong is going to sweep the floor. We get to run through some place that's reminiscent of Super Mario. Your first battle against dragons? I'll show you how tough they are. Nah. Actually, were there any other dragon types really in Generation 2 that were introduced? I don't think there were. Oh yeah, so in this part, prepare to see a lot of Dugong. In fact, Dugong is probably just going to battle throughout the entirety of this gym and not be seen for hours after that. So how are you folks doing? It is the 16th of June at this point. I'm trying to get my car fixed. That's all new that's what new is really happening with me. And yeah, there's not much else I can really go over. Um yeah, it'd be long past. I couldn't. I couldn't even talk about that stream the Runaway guys did because it'd be long past this point unless they happen to do it right before this episode goes up, which would be an odd coincidence. But yeah, for this part, expect to see, see a lot of Dugong using a lot of Ice Beam and Force Battles. This part, this gym is. A strength puzzle gym. I can't afford to lose. I can't believe this. So yeah, it's just all cool trainers with a bunch of... Oh, hello. You are not a dragon, oddly enough. But you are a f formidable opponent. And you're gonna try and... Nah. Uh, Try and reduce my accuracy. Doesn't matter, I'll still jump on you. That's a dragon move. The weakest! The weakest dragon move ever. It did 10 damage, and that's not a fixed damage number either. I still haven't gone and bought hyper potions. <laughs> Oh, uh, I'll probably make sure, I'll have to make sure to do that before I fight uh, the gym leader, which is Claire. I lost. I'm so disgusted. Sure, whatever you say, lady. Now, how do we? Hmm. I'm trying to think of how to do this. Okay, hopefully I only need one stone for each spot. Nope, I think I'm supposed to do it the other way. Get reset. Oh, bugger, I can't. <laughs> Hi, buddy. My chance of losing? Not even 1%. Allow me to beat those odds unless she's running a Cedra. I'm going to do a Dragon Air for once. Oh, what crap, I just remembered. There was one new Dragon type introduced with, with uh, Generation 2 Kingdra. Oh boy. My eye is twitching. And it's annoying me. So anyway, like I said before, I did this backwards.
push, push, push. In it goes. That'll stem the lava throw flow below us. But what I want to do here quick is box that guy in and push this one down. I'm just going to push them all through that I can. I hope I don't have to do both boulders. And then we just fight this guy up top here. Hello, friend. Oh, so he's going to pull a fast one, huh? That's a horsey. That's not stronger than a dragon Pokemon. That evolves into a dragon Pokemon. I'm mean, sure it sounds lovely, I do apologize. There you are. And I'm probably going to throw out Lantern if your next Pokemon is a Seedra. Yep. Lantern, come forth and destroy. For the greater good. That's it. I'm gifted. Uh. Anyway, that was all that. That's all the rock pushing we have to do, I believe. Because then we come down here, walk across this, and go to the gym leader through that one. One last fight for the gym leader, I see. So afraid of your philosophical philosophicallys. I just went through this whole gym and did not use a single potion. I might be able to go straight to the boss. I'm gonna put lantern. Oh. What else can I put out there? I guess I'll put a guinea pig out there. <laughs> Go do gong. Gong gong. Yeah, ice types effective against dragons. All right. So I need a guinea pig out there. Alright, start you for the greater good. Save before challenging a gym leader, as always. Now, the reason. Now, Claire is actually really tough because her team consists of a few Pokemon that are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can hold yourself against Lead 4, but you can't defeat the champion! And. Well, I know who the champion is. Since some, you people, some people at home might be, I may know who the champion is too. All right, Claire, who's the first one you're sitting up? Dragonair. Oh, I could have just started off with Dugong. Oh well. Let's see. Well, let's go ahead. Just whittle it down. Ha ha! You fail a thunder wave. I think all of her Dragonairs have Thunder Wave. There it goes. All of her Dragonairs have Dragon Wave and er, Thunder Wave and Dragon Breath, but and uh, some other move. But then they have one move that's keen to them. Uh, that's keen to them. The cast sets them apart. Like one of them has has Thunder Shock or. Thunderbolt, I should say. 
One of them has Thunderbolts, one of them has Fire Blast, the other has Aqua Tail or Aqua, Aqua Wave or Surf or something like that. Then it's her last Pokemon, which is a Kingdra. Unless she's got a Gyarados hiding in here. But, Dugong will go out and save the day for the, for the children's. Oh, I didn't use a potion. Whoopsie doodles. Oh, I can just use rest when it comes up. Oh. Oh, and the para and the paralysis begins all anew. Oh, that's bad. You're the one with uh, Thunderbolt. But I can live through it. Dugong's a beast. You can live through another one, right? Guess not. Do I, I don't think I have any revives. This could get choppy. Yeah, <laughs> Polywhirl. Going in for the kill. Nope, I will keep this one out. Thank you very much. I'm gonna check my pack and see if I have a revive somewhere. Any revives? No. Alright, well then, I'm just gonna use this tactic. Oh, dang it. They always go for the Thunder Wave. Really? I mean, really? Put it to sleep already! Thank you. And now I'm gonna try and blast it away quickly here. Except I won't move. Polyworld, seriously. Thank you. You could not... Uh, and that's probably going to be the end of you. Can you get the par par paralysis off? Oh, whatever. It's it's over for Polyworld. I want to keep one. In, I want to keep one alive. Uh. <laughs> Go star you. Even though I think this dragon that's gonna kill you. Yeah, I did. Well, wait. What am I worried about? I already got rid of the Thunderbolt one and the probably the Surf one too. Ah, <laughs> go Quagsire! You're faster than it. Let's use Kingdra. Which like yes, I will. I'm actually going to give Lantern a shot. Being disturbed on Skype. Sorry. Kingdra is what Gyarados was supposed to be a water dragon type. Now, hopefully, the spark will get the paralysis off on it so that I can kind of rub it in her face. Critical? No. Oh! Uh, well, it means it has to recharge. 
That was a critical hit. Wow. Done. I win the gym. There must be some mistake. No, no, I'm afraid you lost, lady. Okay. So she has pulled a Whitney and has said, Hey, I don't think you're real. I think you cheated. So I'm not going to let you win until you bring me what I want. Way to go, Nintendo. She knows that the ladies always want something in order for, the, for you to prove your worth. Alright then, so let's go ahead and just push on through this dragon's den. And give the little princess what she wants. Well, that wasn't too bad actually. I mean, I all my Pokemon are level 40 and that fight was easy. I'm surprised she didn't use any items. Uh, I got a few super repels I can use still. Not Poke Gear. So the reason I want to use a super repel is because we're going to go surfing in the water. Wind in the water. So this place, I think there's a few dragon trainers. Let me just sneak around the corners here to make sure. But the main gimmick is there are whirlpools along the floor that you need to get rid of. Getting rid of those whirlpools allows you to progress further. Now, oops, excuse me. Progressing along here will allow you to reach the item that you that you're told to get, the dragon fight, which I gotta remember how deep in it is. And sorry about the little bit of silence there. Somebody came in and talked to me. Oh uh, yeah, this is it right here. That's it, done. <laughs> All right then. Well, I'm actually gonna go ahead and cut here, guys. Wait, go to Newbark Town. Going home. Anyway, so I'm gonna go ahead and cut here, guys, and I'm gonna see you next time. Let's play Pokemon Gold, the Water Mono type challenge. Next time, we head home and and head to the Pokemon League. I'll see you then.